Hello everyone, this is John Quell, and today we are cooking beef riblets on Dishing Out Flavor. I have the riblets here, and then right here I have my combination of seasonings. I have some fresh ginger, some red onion, there's also a little bit of um, scallions here, and then I have some big slices of garlic. And right here, I have a combination of bay leaves, star anise, allspice, and fennel. I'm going to add that to the mix as well. So we'll be braising this with several other seasonings I have here. Traditionally, I would have red chili peppers, but I don't have any fresh chili peppers, so I'll be compensating with the dry. And um, instead of using... Um, like the green onion or the leeks because I went to the store and I totally forgot to get that. But no worries. I'm going to make do with what I have and still make it taste great. I'll be back in a bit. I've added in some water. I'm going to go ahead and add in my beef ribs. Some of you may be wondering, like, really, start anise and uh, bay leaves and fennel and allspice on beef? Trust me, this is truly amazing and so many wonderful health benefits and properties to these spices. It's a must-have, you know, if you're doing this dish. Basically, bombard pretty much all of your foods with um, spices, your body will thank you for it. And so many wonderful benefits, like I said before. Okay, let me go ahead and add the other ingredients. Okay. So, this is my broad bean paste. Normally, I would have fried this in with the oil and the onions and stuff, but normally when I do that, I, I call so much smoke to flare up in the house <laughs> that it ends up uh, choking me. So as long as it's in here, everything will be fine. So add that to the mix. I'll go ahead and I'll add in my soy sauce. This is a dark soy sauce. Some chicken bouillon, some large green sea salt, some cooking wine, chili flakes. Okay, so 
So this is going to cook for about two and a half hours. I'll meet you guys back then. Oops, need to add more water. There we go. And then I'll cover this with a lid. And like I said, I'll see you back in two and a half hours. All right, here are the riblets all done. I'm going to put these on the plate in just a moment. 